Hey guys, it's Kayla from Killing It With Coupons and here is my Office Depot slash Office Max haul for you guys this week. If you guys have either a Office Depot or Office Max, they are the same place now. So whichever one you guys have closest to you, you guys can go to and get the same great savings. So the total retail cost of all of the items that you guys see here this week would have cost me $64.91. I paid out of pocket just $9.09 .09 plus 73 cents in tax and saved $55.09. So pretty nice savings for this week. Um, now, the penny deals that are going on this week, you guys do not need a minimum purchase, which is super awesome because a lot of times um, lately with the penny penny items um, at Office Depot, you do need an additional like $5 purchase. However, you do not need one this week. So if you guys want to just go in for the penny items and, you know, pay the nine cents or whatever it'll be for the three penny items for three of them, you guys will just pay nine cents and walk out happy. <laughs> um, just not even, you know, paying more than a quarter for that. Um, so the deals though that are going on this week, I did a few that are a little bit more not as advertised, such as like the binder clips and then also the food storage bags. Um, just because one, there's a pretty decent price on these and um, also were a little bit low. So since I knew that these were pretty cheap um, at Office Depot this week, I went ahead and picked these up. And then also I have like four binder clips left. And so since I saw they were on sale and there are some pretty good savings on them, I decided to go ahead and pick them up. So those are just the two deals this week that I went ahead and did. They aren't quite as common they're not like on the front page or anything like that all the other other items for this week are on the front page they are all a limit of three with these which is the uh mechanical pencils wood pencils the compasses the protractors the rulers the um notebooks and then also the sharpie markers as well these are no limit on them so you guys could pretty much get as many as you want um, so starting off for, with the first deal for this week on the penny items is the wood pencils. These are super awesome. They are a 12 count of just plain old Office Depot wood pencils. They are normally $1.69. For the three I picked up would have been $5.07. However, they're on sale for a penny. So for the three were just three cents and I saved $5.04. Then the Office Depot plastic rulers. These are also just a penny. Super awesome price on these. Same thing. They're normally 89 cents. For the three I picked up would have been two at sixty-seven. However, again, just three cents for the three and saved two dollars and sixty-four cents. Then the protractors also a penny this week. These are the six-inch protractors. They are normally two dollars and seventy-nine cents. So for the three I picked up would have been eight dollars and thirty-seven cents. However, just three cents for the three I saved eight dollars and thirty-four cents. Then the poly covered notebooks. These are um, pretty nice. Like they've got the, they're not the just um, like cardboard, cardboard coverings on these. So um, these are also a limit of three for the week as well. They're normally one ninety nine for the three I picked up. It would have been five dollars and ninety seven cents. They're on sale for twenty five cents this week. For the, so for the three I picked up was seventy five cents, and I saved five dollars and twenty two cents. Then with the mechanical pencils, if you guys would rather have mechanical pencils, the six count for this week is only 25 cents as well. These are normally $2.99, so for the three I picked up would have been $8.97. I paid 25 cents for each or 75 cents for the three and saved $8.22. Then the compasses, these, the Office Depot brand pencil compasses, these are normally $2.29, so for the three I picked up would have been $6.82. However, just 25 cents, so 75 cents for the three and save $6.12. The next deal I did was on the Sharpie markers. These are also 25 cents as well. They are normally $1.99. For the three I picked up was $5.97. However, the sale was 75 cents for the three and I saved $5.22. Then the uh, gallon sized um, storage bags. Now the gallon sized ones are a different retail price from the sandwich bags. So I'll share with you guys that in a second. But the gallon sized bag, the 12 count, these are normally $4, so for the three I picked up would have been $12. However, they're on sale for $1, so I paid $3 for the three and saved $9. The sandwich bags, the 50 count, 
they are normally two dollars so i ended up paying one dollar with the sale price and saved one dollar and then lastly also like i was telling you guys about the binder clips just because i am almost out of these and i do use these a lot and since they are on sale i decided to go ahead and pick them up they are a pretty decent price they retail at 5.99 they're on sale for two dollars so you save 3.99 so four bucks off of them is a pretty good price so as you guys can see up at the top that was the sharpie markers these were the freezer bags these were the sandwich bags this was the one subject notebooks down here these were the binder clips the uh, wood pencils mechanical pencils the rulers and the protractors the compass and pencil so my subtotal was 909 after tax I paid 982 and saved $55.09 so a pretty good week for this week especially with some back to school deals they have tons of other dollar and two dollar three dollar four dollar deals so guys just flip through their their ads and you guys will find some definitely good deals especially anything that you guys really need for back to school they will tell you on there how much the retail prices so if you guys want to know how much you're going to be saving like maybe if something you think might be a little bit cheaper later on or if it's not necessarily to the savings that you guys would want to have just go ahead you guys can always compare that price to it should be right in the ad right there and it'll tell you what it retails for and then of course what it what it is on sale for um so anyway that is it for me this week if you guys have a haul from any other stores i would love to read see or hear about them via video picture comment you guys can also find these deals and more post at my blog killing it with coupons.com you guys can also follow me on facebook twitter google plus pinterest instagram and tumblr along with our two other youtube channels our daily vlogs and our nizzy net i will post links to all of that in the description below our nizzy net we post new videos every friday and our daily vlogs we post new videos every single day so if you guys will please subscribe over there and here and i will talk to you guys all next week bye guys Hey guys, it's Kayla from Killing It With Coupons and here is my Target haul for you guys this week. So guys, um, one deal that I didn't get to do this week which was on the uh, Kraft Macaroni and Cheeses. Um, they, I posted about this on my blog, it may be regional depending on if it's in your area or not, but they, the Kraft Macaroni and Cheese Cups, the four pack, are 